Hello, this is Al, K0CN, and I'd like to spend a moment to talk about how the Alpha 9500 senses and deals with fault situations that might pose a threat to the amplifier. The manual talks about some 19 different uh, situations that might pose a threat to the amplifier, and the five microprocessors that are on board the various circuit boards uh, sense voltages and currents power both uh, forward and reflected, uh, a number of parameters that can indicate that there is abnormal operation or a situation that may lead to a threat to the amplifier tube or the amplifier itself. If a fault trip should occur, you can press the fault button and it will display a numerical code which you can identify in the manual and see the specific fault that's occurred and the corrective action that you should take. With any fault, the tube bias is off and the RF from the exciter is bypassed to the antenna. So let's say the unthinkable happens and we forget to attach an antenna to our amplifier. I can accomplish that by switching to an empty uh, antenna select. When I key the amplifier, it faults out and we notice it went immediately to fault number 12. The uh, fault code number 12 identifies the fault as high reflected power and certainly that would be the case with no antenna connected. Another common fault would be to overdrive the amplifier. The input power is too high. Let me key the exciter with this condition. I can press the uh, recall button and then the fault button and it indicates fault number four. This indicates a hard plate current trip. There you have a couple of examples of the fault protection system on the Alpha 9500. It's very fast and very effective. Thanks for watching.